Hello. Welcome to the world of EHR systems. Ever wondered how electronic health records are transforming healthcare? From improving patient care to streamlining workflows, EHR systems are revolutionizing the way we deliver and access care. In this video, we'll break down exactly what EHR is, how it works, and why it's changing healthcare for the better. Let's imagine. Imagine you're in an emergency room, needing immediate care. The doctor asks about your medical history, but you can't remember every detail. Now, picture this. A system where your entire health record is just a click away. No delays, no missing information. That's the magic of electronic health records, or EHRs, and today we're diving into how they're transforming healthcare as we know it. So, what exactly is an EHR? In simple terms, it's a digital version of your medical chart. Everything from your allergies to your latest lab results is stored in one place. But it's not just for storage. It's a dynamic tool that connects doctors, labs, pharmacies, and even you, the patient. Think of it as the Google Drive of healthcare, but with way stricter security and regulations. Now you might be thinking why do EHRs matter, and why is it so important? Why are EHRs so important? Let's start with time. Time can literally save lives in healthcare. With EHRs, a doctor doesn't have to call multiple departments to find your records. It's all in one place, ready when needed. Second, accuracy. Have you ever had to explain your medical history five times at different appointments? EHRs ensure that your information stays consistent across all providers, reducing errors. And let's not forget convenience. With patient portals, you can view test results, schedule appointments, and even message your doctor, all from your phone. Now we are getting to the point of how the EHR system works. It starts with patient data being entered by a clinic. This could include medical history, lab results, or prescriptions. That data is then stored in a centralized database, ensuring it's secure and easily accessible. Finally, this information is shared seamlessly with hospitals, labs, and pharmacies to improve care coordination and ensure everyone involved has the most accurate, up-to-date records. This process streamlines healthcare and enhances patient outcomes. Secondly, we should know there are two major types of EHR systems, centralized and decentralized. So how do these systems actually work? In most cases, EHRs use a centralized model where all data is stored in one big, secure database. This makes it easy for doctors and hospitals to access your information. But there's also a decentralized model where each clinic or hospital stores its own data. They don't like to share data. Well, you could still ask them, but might cost you. While this can improve security as it sometimes creates problems with sharing information like data privacy issues. So what happens now? You want your data to be centralized, but at the same time you want data to be protected. So what's the solution? The solution is many healthcare organizations are moving toward a hybrid model that combines the best of both worlds. Let's talk about hybrid models really quickly. It might help you decide which model is best. Then we will move forward to the benefits of EHR systems. A hybrid model for EHRs combines the features of centralized and decentralized systems. It allows data to be stored in multiple locations, but ensures that information is securely accessible through a shared network or interface. For example, in a hybrid model, patient data might be stored locally at individual clinics, decentralized. But with the use of a secure cloud or integration protocols, this information is shared across a network, centralized. This enables seamless data exchange while maintaining control and privacy at local levels. The hybrid model mitigates the risks of relying solely on centralized systems, like data breaches, and the inefficiencies of completely decentralized systems, like poor interoperability. The result is a system where healthcare providers and patients benefit from the accessibility of centralized systems and the autonomy of decentralized systems, fostering better collaboration and patient care. Now, let's talk about the game changers. First up, better patient care. With a complete medical history at their fingertips, doctors can make more informed decisions. Then the second, there's fewer errors. No more illegible handwriting or misplaced files. And finally, cost savings. Less paperwork means less administrative burden and more time focusing on what matters patients. But it's not all sunshine and rainbows. EHR systems come with challenges too. Cybersecurity is a huge concern. 
Keeping sensitive patient data safe from hackers is a top priority. Then there's the usability issue. Let's be real. Some EHR systems feel like they were designed in the Stone Age. Doctors spend hours learning to navigate clunky interfaces instead of treating patients. And let's not forget interoperability. Ever heard of two hospitals using completely different systems that don't talk to each other? Yeah, it's a problem. Let's put the challenges into a scenario. Dr. John, a family physician, struggles with her EHR system. The interface is so clunky and outdated that she spends extra hours documenting patient visits instead of focusing on care. Last month, her hospital experienced a cyber attack that temporarily locked access to patient records, creating chaos in the clinic. To make matters worse, when one of her patients was referred to another hospital, their EHR systems couldn't share data, forcing the patient to carry printed records. Hong on guys if you are loving this video, please take a moment and subscribe to my channel below and leave a comment with any question. I will try my best to answer as soon as possible. So, what does the future hold for EHRs? AI is stepping in to make EHRs smarter. Think predictive analytics that warn doctors about potential health issues before they happen. Wearables like smartwatches are also changing the game, syncing real-time data like heart rates and activity levels straight into your health record. And then there's blockchain, offering next-level security for sensitive medical data. The goal? To create an EHR system that's not just a record, but an active tool for improving health outcomes. I hope I made it easier to understand. Let's just summarize quickly in a few words. EHRs are the backbone of modern healthcare, connecting patients and providers like never before. But they're also a work in progress, with room for innovation and improvement. What do you think? Are EHRs a blessing or a challenge? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more deep dives into health tech. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.